killed this guy? I mean, what didn't kill this guy around here? Well, I mean, this guy was beaten. Wait, wait. and got... out of all the things that thing next, that thing that robot could do, beating somebody isn't one of them. I'm pretty sure it could, but look at the—he's got a note in his hands. Let's see what it says. The guy who turned up today claiming to be Ellis Hill is not who he says he is. I served the real Ellis Hill in Iraq. Oh, he's a veteran. And this ain't him. What's he doing with Ellis's name tags and identification? Even social security number. I wonder what happened to the real Ellis Hill. So he just wrote all that down and then got murdered. You know, people leave these logs everywhere. That they do. Try to get some information out of him, but don't be suspicious. He's staring at me. Okay, I gotta say something. I've been up and down the coast. Up and down a whole bunch of coasts my whole life. A lot of machine shops, engine yards, planes, boats, big boats. You could say I was a born fixer, a can-do man. The bosses point me at a problem, they know it's gonna get fixed. I'll find a way. Tell me more about fixing. In my experience, there's nothing in the world that won't yield with the right tools applied to it. it just might be my mantra. You gotta take pleasure in what you do, don't you agree? That's important. Identify the problem, enact the solution, and reap the rewards of a job well done. Uh-huh. Look, I don't mean to sermonize. I bet people are lining up to tell you what to believe. What yeah. rules you should follow, what morality they define. Mm-hmm. But if you can't find pleasure in acting it out, somebody with your assets could be there's another port out there for you. Keep it in mind. Did he just give you a job offer? He might, but I'm pretty sure the job is going to be you just murdering a bunch of people. Oh, Probably with that shovel over there. Yeah, let me look at the shovel. I was just kidding. I mean, what the... You... Uh, let's see. Okay, it's a trail of dirt. Oh god, that's an actual murder shovel. It may be an actual murder shovel. Let's see. That is a very crude GPS. Was that just drawn by hand? <laughs> I do not know. It's like a step down from, like, Apple's terrible ripoff of Google Maps. It's like a step down from, like, Bing Maps. Uh, I guess it's really not any quicker to go there. Well, I guess, well, the fastest way might just be to go through here. You you really want to do that? I should be okay. I just gotta find a better place to jump. Or a hole in the fence, or... Maybe you could just tunnel under with a spoon. That's a really stupid idea. Do you have anything better? <laughs> Special assignment received. Initializing. Oh god, that was all full of pustules. Yeah. Oof. Yeah, see that? I just learned that trick. That's a nice trick. Unfortunately, it means I have to touch them. Ugh. Seems like a nice variety of them here. Yeah, I mean, points... You know, points for creating a, for a very zombie-killing experience. What is going on? How many undead Incredible Hulks are there? 
Oh, we, we went through an entire... I'd call them Solomon Grundy's, but I don't know who'd get the joke. Or on a Monday? Yeah, that one. Did other stuff on other various days of the week. Oh, what's this? Oh. It, what the f... Oh, dear. Does that mean it did it burrow here? Oh, God. Oh, oh hey. shit. Well, at least I cleared up your mission. Yeah. What is it's that? Really, it's a pod, it looks like. Oh, God, it's open. It just. Wow, it just wrecked this shit. Wrecked all of the shit. Okay. Right, this isn't what I'm here for. Yeah. Okay. I think this might also be where that buried pirate treasure or whatever it is. You know? Uh, oh, yeah, I marked that on my map. Let me find, see if I can find it. Well, might as well do that while I'm out here. Yeah, I mean, you know, since you're in the area. Visual tracking initiated. Visual tracking initiated. Additional assignment received. Initializing. That voice gets annoying sometimes. I know, right? I mean, you should try to hear it on the PA. So where is... So that was where the truck is. Oh, so, okay. Seems to have attracted some admirers. Well, you're very popular. You know, you've got a lot of a lot of followers on Twitter. Apparently, even though I hadn't signed up with half of them, what the hell? Yeah, it's. I I don't understand how Twitter works. The Illuminati wishes we could control that. So this is where the truck came from, and. God, these things do not let up. Like they're protecting something. Oh, God. Yeah, let's just pick a fight with the biggest thing we see. It's worked for me so far. It's so weird when they rise up like that. They got those little dangly pods down there. I did not notice that. It looks like a big wrinkled ball sack. That's probably why I didn't notice it. I was not looking. You're looking. Okay, seriously? That... That's the worst improvised grave I have ever seen. This is a, okay, now I see why they need... Okay, uh... What? The hell? I can find a few things different <laughs> about this guy. Baby. What? What does Alice Hill look like? Um, he's <laughs> white, for one thing. <laughs> oh, so here's the new airport mechanic. The Templars don't really do role-playing. As for the dragon, it all seems too coherent for them. They're more likely to pose as a ceiling fan. I've seen them try that. Surprisingly effective. Smart money's on the Phoenicians. It would explain uh, signals fake Ellis transmits to C and his familiar familiarity with the drug. Carthage is always in it for the money. You could probably buy intel about the fog and other sea related nightmares, but we'd rather you figure things out on your own. It saves us haggling over the price and removing the inevitable knife in your back. Ciao, ciao. Hold on a second. I think the treasure would be over... Yeah? You're still in... Oh, that's another one of these. Oh. <laughs> she actually mentions that she's gonna copy-paste them. Ah. Uh, saw some... Somebody just filled this treasure chest with a bunch of piece of paper saying friendship on them. Really? Wow. 
This was better than that time I found a treasure chest just had a bathing suit in it. Okay. I mean, not, not a bikini, though, the other kind. The story there. It was a one piece. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Dread Pirate met his demise on this island in 1632. Although ballads might be sung of his illuminated downfall, his black heart can no longer terrorize New England. Um. Sounds like a cool guy. I think he's probably gotten back. I think uh, I think that might not exactly be true anymore. Yeah. Who's Dixie Bull? Let me find out. Of course, there'd be pirate zombies. I told you there were pirate yeah, zombies. Yeah, I know. I did. Dixie Bull was actually one of the first pirates uh, to operate around Maine. Huh. That's good. We got the original here. He was a pirate zombie before they were cool. And I think I found him. He looks bad. Oh, that's a lot of things sticking out of him. He's been dead a while. He looks like he's wearing half of a xenomorph costume and half of a pinhead costume. Well, he's dead now. Again. Hooray! He'll be back for several sequels. <sighs> dead genres tell no tales. Disney owns Monkey Island now, and they're never going to do anything with it. Yeah. Probably, they probably own your soul. Does, does he actually traffic in souls? Have you ever sign up for a fast pass system? No. Good. Don't. You, you stay in the lines like everyone else. I don't have enough money to go to Disney. And they're not interested in your soul. Wait, there's somebody in here. There's something in here. Something big. These are aggressive in here. There's a big one in here, and I think I'd probably better take it out. Yeah, you don't want that thing wandering around. Ooh, a bingo machine. It's still on. It's it's still on. Yeah, huh. Great. Are these part part by internally or something? Oh yeah, I mean the bingo cola, you know, it's it's got they gotta keep it fresh. Huh. And I don't have any change. You have to have that treasure chest just said friendship. You have a sledgehammer. Yeah, but that would be wrong. There's another one. Come on. Don't let it's a sign from the Cola Gods. Why are there so many zombies here? I mean, it's not if even one type. Like... Maybe... It might be, like... Maybe this is the zombie's day job. Well, no, these were two... These were two... Okay, the regular zombies I get, those are just, like, workers here or something. The... The, the wet zombies I get, theirs are just, you know... Those, you know, crawled in from the sea. The, uh, the big ones, those are mutants. I got it. And, you know, the ones with the, the, the running ones, those are also mutants. Right. So what about the old ones? What are old and musty, dried bones doing in here? Is this another mass grave? Like, what are they, like, what broke open this box? What? Oh. Oh. Okay, I think I might get it. What? I mean, is there something on that logo there? I can't really see. Yeah, it's kind of faint. It's really hard to see in the dark. I wish I had a flashlight. Yeah. But, yeah, it's a, it's, you might not be able to see it on your feed, but it's like a ship with like a lion's head or something on it, on the sail. And it's purple. The goddamn Phoenicians. 
Wow, they must have been here for a while, even before fake elves. Oh, there's there's ones in the light. Oh yeah, there. Well, more in the light. I mean, the lighting in the zombie apocalypse—you take what you can get. So I wonder if there's like, ah, did these older zombies like were they stored in the crates? I mean, that would not surprise me. Man. Were they shit? Oh my god! Look, wait, go back, go back. What? Look, no, turn around. Uh, turn to the left. Look at this. It's a perfect length to store a body. Uh huh. Interesting. How do I get in here? Oh, that works. Good thing you got those platforming abilities. And that's a miner. Okay, that is. It looks more like a major. Hmm. And he summons the little ones, which are black, all black. Like, okay, what the hell is a miner zombie doing in here? That's a good. He even got a pickaxe. Oh my god. Was he stored in here? And look at that. I'm gonna knock on it. Okay. Oh, well, whatever. Um. No, nope, let's see if at the end here. Or at least whatever's in there is not moving anymore. <laughs> For now. But yeah, I think that's where these things came from. They must have been in those crates. Well, it looks like someone tried to make a stand here, too. Uh, ammo crates, ammo casters, uh, all that stuff. It never works out well. I have some questions for Ellis Hill. Just uh, be careful how you phrase them. Kenji mentioned some transmissions, but... So I guess he... She might know something there that I don't. Hmm. So maybe something she thought I would already know. Yeah, she, she seems to be, like, weirdly inconsistent about what she knows and what she doesn't. Their spirit doesn't break easy, the sea beasts. Spending more time working them over than seeing to the plains. They're about as resilient and twice as stubborn. The sea breathes things tough, scours our weakness. That's how it works. So I really have to go to town with the power tools. But... Spare the rod, spoil the abomination. These birds are all grounded to the fog lifts. Radios, Fritz. I ask you, what else for a man to keep himself occupied with? Not whittling wood, not while we're under invasion. So I've been sapping him off aviation fuel, using it for Greek fire. I thought the recipe for that was lost. Lit him up and shit. <laughs> they didn't like that. Right, of course. No school not like the those Venetians. School when it comes to war. Nope. Extreme measures are timeless. Speaking of such, pray you're out of here before the higher powers do so unto this whole island. <laughs> oh, you don't think they have that plan? <sighs> Drop the bombs and sow the salt. An infamous land where nothing may be built for all time. Okay, we get it. You're from Carthage. Come on, come on, you piece of junk. We got business to be getting on with, you and I. No, oh, you came in quiet. Shit. My senses are getting dulled in here. Got used to the creeps outside. They don't have a light touch. And neither do I. Cracking deadheads keeps my swing in shape and the cabin fever at bay. Man gotta be comfortable with scan company. With keeping to himself. Say, you come from town. Any reception out there? Police, CB? Even the LPFM Gospel Channel, I ain't choosing. 
Nah, just dead air. Not even a score from the Red Sox game. This place is off the radar. So here I am, sitting with my thumb up my ass, tuning static. Like I said, dead. Um, air. Um, Don't shoot waste your time out of the mast. Ain't the kind of equipment you can patch up with duct tape and a wire hanger. No, you just keep on with whatever you gotta do. Elsewhere. He has, he has no neck. His arm is as thick as your torso. I mean, like, I have magic bee powers, but I would not fuck with him. Okay. Where's the radio mast? Oh, there we go. I ran right by it. Let's see if let's see if this is isn't something that can be fixed with duct tape because everything can be fixed with duct tape. Yeah, duct tape or WD forty, depending on what you need to do. WD forty to make it go. D duct tape to make it stop. Oh, let me. Can you check that one out for yeah, me? Yeah, let me look it up. Why is every so I mean, that's, a, that's the one bad thing about, you know, Orochi. Like, if any one of their products you've got to go right through their like their main company website. You can't just, you know, go to, like, the, the Psycho website or the Zagan website. you got to just try to search through the whole of the system. It's easier when you have the serial number. Even so. Okay, this is the Cyclone Series Mast. The Cyclone series is specifically designed for remote area installation and maintenance. No cranes are needed, sections are lightweight, and professional provisional repairs can be carried out without recourse to specialized parts and labor. Primary components, brackets, anchors, antennas, lightning arresters, provisional repair materials, household adhesives, or duct tape, conductors, and amplifiers. Huh. Well, he just... Well, he was lying. Well, let me get some of that stuff. Let's see what he's trying to keep us from. I bet I can probably hack into the... Into the... Get a hack radio. the radio tower, yeah. <laughs> so all you... Let's see. All you really need are duct tape, uh, a wire hanger, and a vacuum tube. Oh, okay. I wouldn't have... I wouldn't have known, um... So is the wire the conductor? Yep. And I guess the uh, vacuum tube is an amplifier. Uh -huh. See, I would have, I would have used a soda can. I mean that. But I guess, but I guess that's probably not. Uh, yeah. You know. Yes. Yeah. I mean. Uh, see, I was thinking. Okay. See, I was thinking of like a. Um, it's like a sound amplifier. That would be. Oh like no! That'd like be like used an for an electrical amplifier. Yeah. Is that duct tape? Yeah. There it is. Oh, that's a big roll. Yeah, this should be easy. You'll never run out with that type of thing. I just jumped over a plane. You did. <laughs> that you did. Ah. All right, let's give this a shot. Oh, that was easy. Mm -hmm. Oh god, Morse code. Ah. Hang on, hang on, I got code breaking software. And by that I mean Google. Play it again for you? Yeah. Just hold my phone up to the speakers here. Drop. Location seven twelve five thirty six. Well, looks like this place over here. All right. Let's go see what the Phoenicians are up to. Okay. Let's yeah. Let's see what they're up to over here. It's got to find a way in. Yeah, they don't like people messing with their stuff. It's like they're kind of using the drug, not as intentionally, but the drug aren't intentionally helping them, but just they're using the drug as cover. It's a good plan. 
the landscape's pretty good too. I mean, all these rock formations are not easy to get in. Okay, what's going on down there? Oh, oh shit. Oh fuck! They're shooting at me! Oh shit, they got a response to you, quick! God damn it, okay! Yeah. I got him! Dibby, watch out! You don't fuck with. I... All right. All right, you go. I got him. Yeah, those were those were people. Uh, uh oh. I killed them. Oh. Debbie, Debbie, hold it together. Okay. Yeah, I kill this thing. Yeah, I can do this. And. What the fuck was that? But I. Do you want me to read it? Yeah. Nice work, MacGyver. Now I know who to call on if my cable goes out. Oh, that reminds me. Don't ever call maintenance in, in the labyrinth, and don't ever get in their way. Yes, they're fixes, but we're not talking cranking the AC, more fixing oh, human problems. Speaking of human okay. problems, if anyone's going to fuck things up on this island, I want it to be God. anyone accountable within our organization. Wild elements of the dragons thing. I bet they're knocking back the sake right now. But next time, there will be a Sorry. next time. You run into these guys... Extreme Prejudice. KG. Oh, it's gonna be an extra, huh? Debbie? <sighs> Debbie, they, they... They came after... They came after you. I know they did. Yeah. I still killed them. I killed them. They're people. Debbie, I know... I, mean, they're too cool, but... I know it's hard. You know, this is... Probably like the first time you had to kill anyone, but like this is something that we just have to. It's not the first time. Oh, what? It's not the first time. 